Hello everybody, Dr. Jerry here again. Today, I want to talk a little bit about the difference between the AAA quantum MRET hydrogen water compared to everything else that's available. The first difference you have to note is this is an FDA registered as a, under the category of medical device. That is very important because you are drinking this water for a long, long time, years. So you want to make sure that the quality of the water is not contaminated with ozone or with oxides or with hydrochlorous acid, which will be very harmful to you. So that is why you must insist on the proper certification. For example, this big machine, you can see the FDA registration here. It has an FDA sticker. And also for the portable device, you also have the FDA registration here. So this will ensure that the water that is produced together with the hydrogen is safe for you. Okay, that's the first difference. The other major difference is something called the quantum energy. Quantum energy is a high frequency molecular vibration that actually vibrates the water molecules. I will explain more later. But basically, it is patented by AAA together with the hydrogen capability, right? As you can see, this is the hydrogen, and you can see the hydrogen gas uh, coming out. And now I will on the quantum energy, which works together with the MRET. I will explain MRET later, but these two works together, high frequency and low frequency. So in terms of the quantum energy, this is what happens. Basically, it's vibrating and shaking the water molecules with this quantum energy effect. You can also see it on this portable device, the same thing. If I on it, you can see it. So what happens is, let me explain here on the board. What happens is, these are H2O water molecules, H2O, 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 H2O. Water tends to exist in a group or we call a cluster. Okay, the H is quite permanently attached to the O through a very strong covalent bond. But the H is also slightly attracted to the oxygen next door. And this H is slightly attracted to the oxygen next door. So they will group together maybe 20 you know, to 50 H2O molecules group together. Which is why when you drink ordinary water, you get filled up very fast and you feel bloated. What happens is with quantum energy, vibration that you saw just now, it will break off the water molecules. Break it out from all these loose bonds that are stuck to each other. Okay? So that the water molecules will shoot out. Okay? And what happens now is the H2O itself is about 0 0.3 nanometer. So it becomes a very tiny, very small molecule that is easier to penetrate and to flow. And this is the first technology that is patented by AAA. The second technology is called MRET. It stands for Molecular Resonance Effect Technology. And this is always at 7.8%. Seven point eight hertz is important because that is the universal vibration frequency. It is a low frequency. What it does is, it does two different things. It will pull back the H two O and realign it. into the single file alignment. So when that happens. The water that enters your bloodstream is able to flow easier 
about three to six times faster in terms of ability to bring the hydrogen into your tissues and into your cells. So this is the first effect of the MREP. The second effect, this is the cell and it's able to penetrate the cell and it will flow also into your brain a lot easier and it will carry the hydrogen together with it. The second part of MREP is the hydrogen bond itself. When you have the 2H, sorry, you have the H here, you have the 2H and the O and mix up the H2O. In ordinary water, you will find that this angle is 104.5. If you drink spring water, mountain water that is fresh from the mountain, it is, nature makes it 109.5 degrees. But because this water has been processed and uh, sanitized through our municipal system, the water angle of the hydrogen has decreased to 104.5. But when you apply the 7.8 curves, this angle is stretched to 114.5 degrees. So you've got a 10 degrees stretching of the hydrogen bond. So what happens, the hydrogen in the water becomes very much activated. It is energized to a higher level that it can do a lot of health benefits for you. And that is the second effect of the MREP. And how do we know this? Well, we have a frequency meter that you can measure. If I on it, the MREP, you can see the 7.8 Hertz and the 350 Gauss is the strength of the magnetic field. So 7.8 Hertz is very, very important. It cannot be less or more. 7.8 is the perfect peak. You can go a little bit off, but the power will not be as much. If you take the smaller device, the portable AAA water device, you can also see this. If I on it, you can also see the effect of the 7.8 MRET. On it, you can see it. All right. So this is very important. And so the three major differences in conclusion is the FDA to ensure your safety, the quantum energy to ensure that the molecules are broken up, and thirdly, the MRET whereby you will realign the water molecules and also energize the hydrogen so that all this combined together makes this a very good medically certified device. Thank you all.